Though his fight with Majin Buu, Goku was revived, he now spends his days training so he can get even stronger. However, he is soon to encounter a new and even more powerful, a new and even more powerful enemy. While Goku is training, the God of Destruction, Lord Beerus, shows up to Boma's birthday party, apparently in search of a Super Saiyan God. No one stands a chance against Beerus, who has the power to destroy everything. The help of his family and friends, Goku awakens as a Super Saiyan God and takes Earth's fate in his hands as he steps up to the plate against Beerus. Let's go, Lord Beerus, you and me! But if I win, you have to leave this planet untouched. Deal? Very well, I accept your terms. But know this, none in this universe can hope to match the power of Beerus the Destroyer. I'm not done yet! Goku has been beaten down, but he's not out yet. Holding on to his tight will to fight, he rises to face Beerus once more. Did the Super Saiyan God thing work? I don't know. It sure seemed like it did. But I can't sense my dad's energy at all. Believe it or not, that's good news. The energy that radiates from a god cannot be detected by mere mortals. I'm not done yet. Finally, this is what I've been waiting for. What do you say we continue this fight on equal footing? God to God. Sounds good to me. I'm only scratching the surface of this new power. thing is that they're not giving me a chance to defend myself. As I just wasn't supposed to win that fight. So Weez is over here breaking the fourth wall. Did the Super Saiyan God thing work? I don't know. It sure seemed like it did. But I can't sense my dad's energy at all. Believe it or not, that's good news. The energy that radiates from a god cannot be detected by mere mortals. Here we go. This is more than enough for you. You see the difference between us? I'm not done yet. This is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> what do you say we continue this fight on equal footing? God to God. Sounds good to me. I'm only scratching the surface of this new power. 
Here we go. This is more than enough for you. You'll see the difference between us. I'm not done yet. I will destroy you. You're a real pain in the neck. This is the end for you. It is not doing bro. Goes higher and higher! between us. Get any stronger unless you face me with everything you've got. Are you always this talkative? You just don't get it. Guess that was it. Top his impressive attempt left an impression. Beerus and his companion leave without destroying the earth. A short while later, Vegeta and Goku train with Whis and Beerus attendant, who was also a teacher. Um, both awaken Super Saiyan God forms and its incredible power. However, back on Earth, Frieza has been resurrected by the Dragon Balls and brings an army to Earth to take revenge on Goku. Gohan tries to stop Frieza, but he is no match for Frieza's new and improved strength. By the time Boma's SOS reaches Goku and Vegeta, Piccolo is already dead and things are, aren't looking much better for Gohan. However, Earth is far too distant from the planet where his father is for Gohan to sense any key, meaning he cannot travel via instant transmission. But just as all seems lost, Gohan summons the last of his strength to enhance his key. Goku's finally able to sense him using instant transmission. He goes to face Frieza once, once more. Hey, Vegeta. Sorry, but I've got to run. Ugh, fine. Do whatever you want, as usual. It occurs to me. I suppose I should thank you. Thank me? What in the world for? For years, my every step... My every breath has been motivated by a single desire. Revenge. My new power, strength enough to hold the universe by its throat. It was you who gave it to me. Losing to you, to a pathetic Saiyan. It consumed me. The humiliation was too much to bear. Enough! Get to the point! Ah, impatient as ever. Very well. As a token of my gratitude, I will destroy you first. <laughs> I knew it! You've been holding something back, haven't you? That's well deduced for a simpleton. I've held back just like you. Then let's both go all in. No tricks, no reserves. I'm not All right, now it's your turn. Let's see this new power of yours. Care to come to the chase, do we? Very well, then I won't hold anything back either. Now brace yourself. Behold my newfound evolution. 
I know gold's a bit gauche, but I wanted to ensure you grasp my new position atop the pecking order. And for the sake of your feeble mind, let's keep the name simple as well. We'll call this Golden Freezer. Golden Freezer? Farewell, Goku. I can say it's been a pleasure. I'm not normally one for preemptive goodbyes, but there is a very real possibility that I'd kill you instantly. And I'd rather be safe than sorry. You've always been smug, but I guess you've earned it this time. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I have to go to training mode to practice my defense because I'm not liking how I'm playing right now. I'm not liking it at all. Uh, I'm, I feel like I'm just barely getting by and this is on default. Frieza, once and for all. I couldn't have put it better myself. Imagine <laughs> this is after he blew it up already, and we had to. Reverse time for three minutes. He's defeated Beerus' his twin brother Champa appears, and Goku and his friends get caught up in an argument between the two brothers. Then they learn that there are a total of 12 universes, which th with theirs called Universe 7. Moreover, they're also apparently exist Super Dragon Balls in Universe 6, Champa's home, as well as Universe 7.